Good morning. For today's video, we are going to discuss order of operations. Order of operation follows the GEMDAS rule. GEMDAS stands for G, grouping symbols like brackets, braces, and parentheses. E stands for exponent. In this case, 5 is the exponent. M stands for multiplication. D stands for division. A stands for addition and S stands for subtraction. So what are the rules in order of operations? Note, if division is to the left of multiplication, do it first. For example, 8 divided by 4 times 2. So first, we are going to divide 8 and 4. So 8 divided by 4 will give us 2 times 2. So the next operation is multiplication. 2 times 2 will give us 4. So the answer for this expression is 4. Next, if sub subtraction is to the left of addition, do it first. For example, 8 minus 4 plus 2. So first, we have to subtract 8 and 4. So 8 minus 4 will give us 4, then plus 2. After subtraction, we will now add 4 plus 2. The answer is 6. Let's have another example. 67 plus 33 divided by 3. First, let's evaluate. What are the operations involved in this example? So we have addition and division. Following the, the GEMDAS rule, so we will be having first division. So 33 divided by 3 will give us 11. So after division, we will now add. So 
67 plus 11, the answer is 78. Example number 2. 8 times 4 divided by 2 plus 7 minus 5. First, let's evaluate the given expression. What are the operations involved in this example? So we have multiplication, division, addition, and subtraction. Following the GEMDAS rule, so we have to multiply first. So 8 times 4 will give us 32 divided by 2 plus 7 minus 5. So after multiplication, we will now proceed to division. 32 divided by 2 will give us 16 plus 7 minus 5. After division, we will now proceed to addition. 16 plus 7, the answer is 23 minus 5. After addition, the last operation is subtraction. 23 minus 5, the answer is 18. For example, number 3. 10 plus 2 times 6 minus second power of 3. Let's evaluate this expression. What are the operations involved in this example? So first, we have a grouping symbol. We also have exponent. We also have multiplication, addition, and subtraction. So in this case, we will focus first to the grouping symbol. Remember, we will start solving to the numbers inside the grouping symbol. And that is 2 times 6 minus second power of 3. The operations inside the grouping symbol is multiplication, subtraction, and the exponent. So we will start with E, exponent. So second power of 3 have the standard form of 9. Second power of 3 is equal to 3 times 3. So after the exponent, we will now proceed with multiplication. 
2 times 6 will give us 12 minus 9. So after multiplication, the last operation inside the grouping symbol is subtraction. So we will now subtract 12 minus 9 will give us 3. And last, the last operation is addition. 10 plus 3, the answer is 13. Always remember, order of operation follows the GEMDAS rule. GEMDAS stands for grouping symbols, exponent, multiplication, division, addition, and subtraction. Note that if division is to the right, or I mean to the left of multiplication, do it first. If subtraction is to the left of addition, then do it first. Thanks for watching. Do not forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Bye!